Hello everybody, this is Serpent, and as you can see, I have descended into the abyss that is Fortnite. <laughs> um, yeah. So, they came out with a, a new creative mode, and I have some, uh, I have some free time on my hands for the first time in a little while. Not enough to make a full episode, but I can do something here. <laughs> so, considering that I have plans to record something with Brick in a couple of days' time after my finals, I am planning on making an arena in this thing so that we can do some Fortnite together, <laughs> because I know he likes that. <laughs> so, yeah, I will uh, I will do that this episode. I don't have enough time to do another Spanish one, but I don't think anyone is really bothered about that. I mostly do those for my own benefit. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, I will do something of that sort in this episode. So. If you are unaware, you can spawn in a couple uh, pallets in this mode, and you can use them to build. So I'm going to be putting one, let's say, there. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So you can use all of this stuff to build in your arena, and I'm going to firstly make a wall, because I want this to be an enclosed arena with no building. Um, just sort of a, a fighting arena. And I'm going to start this off with probably a wall over here. And then I will... Oh, it's a little laggy. <laughs> and then I will bring the wall probably somewhere pretty far over. But not, not all that far, but pretty far. <laughs> and we'll, we'll, we'll just see in a couple minutes how this uh, ends up being sized, because I don't quite know at the moment. I need to figure it out. All right, we have a uh, we have a an outline here, and I'm going to fill in the floor and ceiling in a minute. Probably the ceiling last because I kind of want to be able to get to my pallet. <laughs> uh, also, that pallet does not have the other thing that I need. I need floors and other such <laughs> things. So let's toss another one there. All right, does this one have floors? This one does not have floors. Okay, maybe this one did. It did not. Alright, I'll find them later. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, I have filled it in. I decided on a 9x9x5, nine by nine by no, 6 block, uh, block, hall, block high thing. And I want, to, I want to try and make this a 3D sort of arena with, uh, with different layers on top of each other. Because we have the opportunity to do that, and I think that'll be pretty fun. Um, so, I'm going to try and find some floors, <laughs> and then we can get started on the interior. Okay, so I have built something, and I found some floors. This thing here, the pillar, I don't like it. Not, uh, not too much because it doesn't look good, I think it looks fine. It's a little bit orange, maybe. <laughs> um, but, mostly just because it was really hard to build, and I don't want to waste a lot of time like that. <laughs> So, instead, I will not do that, and I will continue on with the plan I had current I had uh, before I did that, which is to put a little railing around here for the start. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> um, I want a platform up in the sky, right? So that seems like that seems like a good place to start. And we could put this here instead. All right. Yeah. Now, this seems like a bad place to go at the moment, though. We need um, we need some way to get away from it, to hide, or some cover, or something. So we can do cover with blocks. I like those blocks uh, that I haven't placed yet. <laughs> um, where are they? They might actually be at the top. Nope, they aren't. Anyway, there's, there's a big pallet of blocks somewhere. So I, I like those. I'll use them at some point. Uh, but... Until then, I want to put something in the way of the area there. I want it to not be quite so easy to kill the person standing there. So does this work? I don't think you can place it there. No, you cannot. So instead, let's take another platform. Let's put that there, get rid of that. And actually, let's punch a hole through the wall here. <laughs> I want some way of... Uh, some way of getting out other than flying over it's too slow so we can we can pop some walls down here something like that 
and I kind of want a stubbier wall here. Nope. <laughs> oh wait, that that did place the right. Uh, that that did go in the right place. I was surprised by that. <laughs> All right, something like, something like that seems pretty good. Now this should go somewhere, shouldn't it? So let's take another ramp off from the side of it. And that's the highest we can go. So let's put another platform up here. And we can have it go around a little. I'll probably turn that into thinner stuff like that. Seems like a good idea. But the stuff floating in midair is probably just going to be squares. Because I don't think there's too much in the way of... Uh, what is it? Too, too much in the way of small stuff that doesn't go up against a wall. I think all of it is supposed to go against a wall. Except maybe that, but eh. <laughs> it doesn't it doesn't really work so well as I could demonstrate if I was going to be uh, boring. <laughs> anyway, I think I'll probably take another couple of minutes to put some more stuff in. Uh, I want to Basically, I just want it to be a multi-layered arena that uh, hopefully is fun to play in. <laughs> so I'll I'll start working towards that again. All right, so I have actually done a whole lot of work since the last clip. It's it's done actually, all done. <laughs> um, I I actually wasn't planning on finishing that, but I ended up doing so. So I'll just show you around a little. Uh, each of these each of these things here, those platforms, those are spawn pads. So the player will spawn there. Ideally, they will not spawn there when we open the map up, though, which I'm hoping will happen, but I tested it once and it didn't look so good, so maybe that's not going to happen. Um, anyway, we'll see. But for the moment, I want to take a look around. It's ju it's basically just a bunch of platforms, a bunch of walking around uh, areas, a lot of, uh, a lot of verticality and change in height, layers, all that stuff. But now it's time to put on the roof, so I will get started with that. I've also tried something out, a little bit of a spawn uh, a spawn mechanic. So this, uh, this spawn pad here is set to the island start, so I'm hoping that when you spawn in for first time you'll go here. I'll have a bunch of chests for weapon picking, and once you've picked a weapon, then you can go into the happy fish open sign thing and <laughs> get killed, and then ideally spawn inside the arena. I'm not quite sure if that's how things are going to work, though. Don't know how finicky it's going to be. Uh, for the meantime, I need to uh, finish off these roofs, so I will get back to you when that's done, and then we can actually test the thing in, uh, yeah, in the main by, by going out into the main area and then uh, coming back in. Alright, that's great. So now it should be saved, everything should be fine. I can go back to the creative hub and I can leave. Leave match. So, once I've done this, I should be able to go back in and ideally the spawning will work. So I'll... I'll uh, <laughs> I'll live through all these uh, loading screens and then we'll see what happens with that. Alright, here we go. Set to Island 2. Let's see what happens. Yes! Excellent. We are in the right place. And when I start the game, these traps will be able to kill me. So, the killing chamber will work. All that is excellent. So, now, now I just want to add the chests and the llamas for getting... Uh, ammo and uh, tool tools and ammo, weapons and ammo, respectively. Um, okay, so I will add those and we'll see what happens later. Alright, I have various chests <laughs> organized. This is the spawning room that I've set up. Uh, if you head through the open sign, there's a one-way trip into the arena. <laughs> And if you don't, then you can gather up some resources here before the fight. So I'm going to attempt to show you this stuff. Let's uh, set this to... where is it? None. Alright. Spawn location... Yeah, spawn pads. 
Um, anyway, free to play, all that good stuff. Let's start the game. Game starting. And... Darn it. <laughs> Alright, that is not exactly where I want to spawn. Ha. Huh. Oh, uh, well. In that case, a bit of a flaw. <laughs> I'll try and figure that out somehow, but I will also currently make my way over there so that I can show you the cool stuff. Alright, we've made a, uh, <laughs> an incon- an un- uh, unorthodox way into the spawn area and I will show you what's uh, what's what with these chests <laughs> so these ones over here they give you weapons <laughs> um, weapons and other things also a lot of ammo <laughs> um, eh, good and a slurp juice so basically one of all the all the max rank weapons and then a couple other things thrown into boot this thing these ones over here are healing supplies and these ones over here are explosives and other consumables <laughs> all right so let's uh let's grab a little a little bit of stuff um maybe maybe a quad launcher and grapplers. I like grapplers. Uh, also these. These are good. <laughs> okay, that that's enough though. And then let's head into the arena. This is how it's supposed to work. <laughs> uh, huh. And we are spawned in, into the arena with all our stuff. Alright, so then, I haven't set any settings, so we can still explode stuff, but I have also figured out that, uh, in other testing, that the settings are very, very glitchy. <laughs> you can't really use them. Um, some of them are mutually exclusive, and some of them can be acquired if you change them one at a time between applying, but it is pretty weird, I've found, so... Oh, these things drop. Right. <laughs> anyway, this stuff all resets when I uh, when I end the game, so I don't feel bad about exploding it. <laughs> okay, so I am a little bit upset about the fact that the spawn area doesn't work, though. I don't know how to fix that. I'll have to try and figure that out somehow. Other than that, though, I think that's about all the... Uh, Oh wait, I got teleported back here when I, uh, when I did that. Huh. That's weird. Anyway, other than that, I think this is pretty much done, so I'm going to say goodbye now. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. I can't look at you and I can't wave. <laughs> but, uh, yes, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. I will, uh, see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.